Hello everyone, I quickly wanted to do one video about a particular vulnerability that came up yesterday and it was discovered by Qualys engineer and we have the CVID 2021 3156 and it's a heap based buffer overflow in sudo. It's a very interesting one. Uh, we pretty much looked at uh, all kinds of Linux starting from Amazon Linux, SUSE, CentOS, Red Hat, uh, Fedora, any Linux that you have where people are using the sudo command, they're affected. And a lot of versions, especially 1.8.2 to 1.8.31 p2 and 1.9.0 to 1.9.1, all of them are, are vulnerable. Now, interestingly, I, when I looked at the vulnerability CVSS score uh, between Amazon Linux, SUSE to say Red Hat, it never crossed uh, 8. I think the highest I saw is 7.8. So it's like a medium to like a very high, but it's not critical. Uh, but if you think how easy this vulnerability to exploit, okay, so that's uh, unbelievable that uh, people are not uh, calling it out as a critical vulnerability. Maybe the reason behind you still need some kind of account like a local account or a system account or of some account of some kind. So you can uh, use the sudo edit command to, to escalate uh, your privilege. Now they even have a... a, a the, a vid video where you can exactly know uh, how to perform this particular action uh, they have got good code why is this uh, thing is vulnerable and why sh you should fix it Red Hat I, I saw that they have already uh, released a patch and uh, they have workaround as well uh, here uh, they have given us uh, some solution as well in here if you run the quality scan uh, you will know so at the bottom uh, here you can look at it how many different people they have already released advisory like the Amazon Linux Gain2 uh, then Ubuntu security notifications who say Debian who say and uh, this is the local from uh, uh, from from uh, Qualys itself <clears throat> so let's maybe take a look at this one and we'll look at the uh, Red Hat real quick so this one is just looking at the uh, email thread. Uh, let's just go back uh, at the top uh, and copy this one. Okay. And what we'll do, we'll quickly go and search for this one. And I'm just going to add rail to it. Okay. So Red Hat customer portal. So this is the enterprise version of Linux that most enterprise uh, business they will be using. And if you look at it, they're calling the CVSS score, base score is 7.8. And if you look and click on it, you see that attack vector is local, but complexity is very low. Privilege required, very low. User interaction is none. And if you look at the impact to the confidentiality, integrity, and availability, it is very, very high. Um, so let's uh, go back one more time and uh, over here uh, I think they have uh, given us the mitigation plan mitigation even if you don't have the patch it's uh, pretty simple you will have to install the required packages for system tap you run this command and then you create a system tap script like this and you will have to install the script uh, with a nohub uh, step and just run this run this particular command and that should take care of it okay so uh, what I think uh, this vulnerability for many organizations you may want to look into that uh, because a lot of people are, are using Linux although this vulnerability it is rated as 7.8 since this one may have a very high attack surface there could be a lots of machines and especially if you have any other vulnerability that can be exploited in combination with this it could cause some serious damage to your linux system so in this video i just wanted you guys to be aware of it 
and take necessary actions. Stay safe and uh, enjoy your Linux. Thank you.